Hey guys, Everything for Tech here, and as you can see from the title, this is a speed test between the iPad 2 and the iPhone 4S, which was just released today. Check out my channel for my videos on that. Um, so I cleared the, well, let me just try to do these together. I cleared the history and the cookies from each one, as you can see here, I can't click on them, and again on the iPhone, so we can't click on them. And I also cleared the multitasking tray for all of, for both. So now we're going to just head into Safari. Okay, we'll go here. Blogs. And I have Mac rumors uh, both ready in my bookmarks. So I'm going to just try to tap those as both as fast as I can. Oh, that didn't work. I'm not going to be doing any editing uh, for this video, so I'm going to just go back into here. And clear, clear. Uh, okay, so let's try this one more time. So they're off. And the iPad 2 uh, did finish first. And surprisingly, this is on the mobile site. So you would think that the mobile site would load a little faster. But I guess my thoughts were wrong. Let's see what else we got in here. Let's go ahead and uh, load uh, apple.com. Ready, go. So the iPad 2 was a little faster. Um, yeah, they're both non jailbroken, uh, both running iOS 5, the latest one. Um, so they are very close to each other. I'm going to go ahead and do one more. Um, we'll run YouTube. Probably load the mobile site. So if you saw that, the, iPad, uh, the iPhone 4S was a tiny bit faster, but not too much. So using both these devices, you're not going to get any uh, much of a difference on speed. They're both significantly fast. They're both running. They both have the uh, A5 processor, 512 uh, megabytes of RAM. Um, so you know they're both pretty good competitors to each other. And I'm very satisfied with both of these machines, devices, Apple things we got here. All right, so that was my video. Hope you liked it. Subscribe up probably here. View my channel for more videos. Like it. Comment. Leave some feedback. I'd love to know what you like. Peace.